The CFS MapDraw Program MapDraw is a program that allows you to draw a job layout directly on a Google Map or satellite image and send it to any Scratch Builder. It is a job input program only available to customers on the current version of CFS. When you open MapDraw, you will see an area to enter customer information or select a customer that you've already saved. To pull up a location on Google Maps, you'll need to enter in an address. Once the program has enough information to locate an address, you'll see a checkbox on the right-hand side of the window that says, Load Map at this address. Click Continue, and the address will then be loaded on a Google Map. You can maximize your window and zoom into the location until it is a comfortable size for creating your job. You can also toggle the map between map view, satellite view, and even street view. Personally, I prefer satellite view for drawing. Keep in mind that you should stay in one view for the entire drawing. If you start drawing in satellite view, you should not switch midway to map view and vice versa. You always want to start on one side of the fence and work your way around to the other side. To begin a layout, click once where you want your fence to begin. Then, click where the first stretch will end. Your next stretch will continue from your previous terminal post. Continue in this manner until you have drawn the entire fence. If you make a mistake, you can always click Undo or drag your terminal posts to adjust them. The program will track the adjustments and recalculate the distance. Please keep in mind that gates must be entered as their own stretches. If you forget to add a stretch for a gate, you can split a line of fence and adjust the distance for each segment so that it accommodates your gate width and the desired length of the fence. To end a fence and begin a new line of fence, simply click New Start Point. Start the next line of fence by clicking the starting location and continue as before. As you input each stretch, a box on the right hand side of the screen will keep track of the job layout and what has been included. Now that I've drawn the fence, I'm going to change a couple of the stretches into gates. In the job description box, I'll select the 10 foot stretch, and in the segment control area, I'll change the segment type from fence to a double gate. Click on the gate swing option to change the swing of the gate. Now I'll change the 4 foot section to a single gate. Click on Gate Swing until it is set up the way that you want. Click to change the swing. Click again to change the latch post. I will also adjust two of the posts from the end post to tie-ons because the customer has indicated that they have permission to tie onto the existing fence. Select the 32 foot stretch to change the end post. Then select the 7 foot stretch to modify that end post. The total distance of the job as well as the total number of gates are summarized in the lower right hand corner of the map draw window. Now that the job layout is complete, I am going to capture an image of the job layout with the Google Map to use on a contract. I'll click Estimate and move straight into the Vinyl Estimator. All of the information saved in the MapDraw layout will automatically be pulled into the Scratch Builder. For speed, I'll choose a standard spec that I have already set up. This will take me straight to my job description where I'll need to answer some questions about my gates.
Notice that once the gate options have been selected, my job layout will automatically be loaded. Click Finished and the Reports menu will become available. A detailed estimate of the job materials has also been automatically generated. And using DocForge, I can print a contract that will feature the map and job layout that I saved from MapDraw. Without even setting foot on the property, I have a realistic estimate for my customer and a contract personalized for their property. More information on MapDraw can be found in your CFS user manual.